herself stalking her social media pages. when I say this, Corey, but Carmella truly loves to have fun. I hate you, Byron, so much. Almost as much as you hate fun? Come on, I'm ready for a dance break. One of these days, Byron, they're gonna shut off your microphone, and I cannot wait. I think she's an unbelievable talent. Mella is money. Alexa Bliss looks ready for a fight tonight. When doesn't she, Saxton? The goddess is always prepared for action, always prepared to find an opening, an advantage in competition. That is what has brought her so much success in the women's division. And across the way, you've got Carmella, who's always thinking a step or two ahead of her opponent. Trust me, Saxton, no one from Staten Island's ever thought a step or two ahead of anyone. Carmella seems to be the exception as much as she's been underestimated in her career. She always seems to have a solid game plan going on into her matches. No one's backing down here. What an impasse. And now it's Carmella. And now here's Carmella. Goddess in control. Into the STO. For as good as Carmella is, Corey, the unfortunate truth is she's not above bending the rules a bit to gain an advantage. <laughs> I don't know what's so unfortunate about that, Cole. The goal is to win, and there are few better at finding different ways to win than Carmella. Oh, what a snapmare! Oh, perfectly executed. Carmella with a nice reversal. Whoa, it's another reversal. Look at this. Oh, from the rope. Well, Corey Crilly has no issue with Carmella's nefarious in-ring style, but Byron, their opponents most certainly do. They do, Michael, but they also know what they're getting into ahead of time. So they know that they have to be on the lookout all match long for any shortcuts Carmella might take. Alexa Bliss may be small, but it actually gives her a speed advantage against pretty much every superstar she faces. Well, looks like she's going to need it during this match. Carmella letting her opponent know how she feels. She's got to remember to get back in the ring before the referee's 10 count. the best job in the world. I get to sit here and call action of the greatest athletes on the planet today. Back in from the floor. She may be one of the WWE's smallest superstars, but Alexa Bliss has proven herself dangerous in the ring. Byron, what strategy should a competitor use against Little Miss Bliss? Well, Michael, as you mentioned, Bliss is the smallest woman competing in WWE, and you have to use your size advantage against Alexa. Keep her grounded, and you won't get hit by Twisted Bliss or insult to injury. And here we go now. Elbow drop. Outstanding focus by Alexa Bliss. Soup 
suplex. Earlier in this matchup, Byron gave me his insight into his strategy against Alexa Bliss. Now, I have to ask Corey, what do you think the key to beating Bliss would be? You know, normally I'd be insulted by you asking Saxton about wrestling strategy before me, but I gotta say, there aren't too many ways to beat the guys. Even if you ground her, she's still all the way from the top. Alexa Bliss gonna be taking that dirt now. But now, can Alexa Bliss capitalize? Nice kick out. Will this be enough? One, two, three. Alexa Bliss did it. Here is your winner, Alexa Bliss! Wow, huge pinfall win here tonight. And to be honest, Michael, neither of these amazing women have anything to be ashamed of. What an effort we saw here. Truly a great match.